Tommy Oak Welton, everybody but him. Uh, for Shelby Wilson! Uh, it blows, so now I do. 
<laughs> no, it's funny. I actually, this is a fantastic time of year for me. I love it. I love spooky season. Hello, you'll see me at Target tomorrow morning, bright and early. Um, but I actually met my boyfriend, been in for three years, and we met in October of 2020. I know, yeah, talk about scary, pandemic dating. That's a thing. Um, but yeah, we met three years ago, and I remember what made me fall in love with him, because he's incredibly hairy for an average young man, so I was convinced he was a werewolf. <laughs> I really wanted to make him part of my decorations. Three years, he's still there. It's actually very economical dating a hairy guy. You save so much money on floss. <laughs> Thank you. There you are. It took a little bit for us to get there. Let's double down. Um, so when I met him, he had a job. Does it now, but I felt really guilty at the time because, uh, you know, like many of us said, during that tumultuous period by pandemic, there was so much going on, so many movements. And I'm sure a lot of us here also said on social media, uh, we should eat the rich. Now I'm dating a guy who makes more money than me. Conflicted, but I held up my end of the bargain. It was just more of a liquid diet, you know? <laughs> Sorry, Oakland. Don't worry, she's still woke. It was very sustainable. It was like a reusable straw situation. <laughs> Bring your own. Oh God, it's amazing that I've known this guy for three years because I came into the relationship with so many trust issues. You guys, I had somebody really mess me up a couple years back. Um, but don't worry, like any modern young woman, I am self-medicating with podcast horoscopes and booze. Yeah, she's a Sagittarius sun, but an alcoholic rising. <laughs> it works out great. And all of these podcasts, they tell you, they're like, you should be grateful. You should be grateful for all your past experiences, including Josh, level one programmer at Google, okay? Yeah, the guy from the front dressed so plainly loud that's so hard. You work in tech, don't you? Yeah, because you know where, what, what did you do you work in? Nonprofit work, okay, money means nothing to you. True. <laughs> Anyway, so I've come to terms with being okay with this asshole fucking up my ability to trust, right? Like, I've been grateful. I'm grateful for that experience because, funny enough, I have a Bachelor's of Science in Fashion Merchandising, but I qualified for a Master's in Criminal Justice when I detailed the detective work I did in my last relationship. <laughs> Same degree as Elle Woods, but I will find shit out like the girl with the dragon tattoo, okay? <laughs> I also think it's really funny because uh, I have a bachelor's of science in fashion, you guys. Science should sue for defamation. All right, thanks so much.